Good morning, it's another beautiful Disney World morning. Pam says hi. We're walking into my favorite park, which is Disney's Animal Kingdom Park. Planning to spend the morning here and then take an afternoon break and then come back in the evening because I just snagged a last minute fast pass for a flight of passage for this evening. So I think we're gonna kind of, oops. So I think we're gonna kind of split up our day, but that's good because this park gets real hot and it's nice to be able to take a midday break. Anyway, time for bag check. My name is Jess. I'll be your safari guide out here in the big wildlife reserve We're in the front this morning. Row. Take a look right above your heads. Uh, as you look at the different giraffes, you can notice the pattern of patches on their coats are unique to each giraffe. Ones are a dark color that protects them from getting sunburnt because giraffes eat 20 hours a day, consuming 75 pounds of leaves. They only sleep for about 30 minutes in a 24-hour period. Wow. Females do the majority of that hunting though, while the males protect the territory. Now right now these lions can see just as well as we do. Once that sun goes down though, their night vision six times better than ours. As you see his mane's already starting to turn darker. Eventually it'll turn black. Oh, it's an amazing morning in Animal Kingdom. We had a great safari. All the animals were out. The lions were up. The painted dogs were like rolling around in the grass. It was an awesome safari. So there's always this rumor that going first thing in the morning is your best bet. And I think that's actually true. Anyway, we're heading over to Expedition Everest. I'm just so happy. This park is my heart. Um, I'm such a sap. Some kids are drumming over there. It's not my best sunglasses choice, but sorry. It is time. Spooky back here. Look at those guys, freaky. We just checked in for breakfast at Tusker House. That's a character breakfast. Uh, we did this a few years ago. It was good. Pam loves character breakfast, so we're doing a bunch of them this trip. And um, we're hungry. It's like 10.30, a little after 10.30 in the morning, so it's time. Definitely time for breakfast. And then we've got a couple more fast passes, and then we're gonna take a break. We just got seated at Tusker House. We got the, whatever they, what they call the juice, but it's good. It's like guava, passion fruit, orange. It's really sweet. Oh yeah, it's really sweet. I'm gonna go eat some food because there's no characters in sight. I just got back from my first trip to the buffet. The food looks really good here. Um, I got some scrambled eggs and sausage. The roasted potatoes look good. And then I saw this cauliflower salad, which looks amazing. That is not something that you see at most Disney breakfast buffets, as well as, um, a jalapeno cornbread, which I'm super excited about that as well. And then I saw this, and this right here is called the Zebra Coffee Cake. It looks awesome. Never seen this before, so I'm excited to dig into this meal. Zebra coffee cake. It is delicious. So I'm pretty happy with this breakfast. We met all the characters in like less than 20 minutes. And it's very efficient and fun and magical. There goes Goofy. We are checking out the revamped bird show in Animal Kingdom. It now has an up theme. So I'm excited to see that. I love birds and I love up. So hopefully it's awesome. It looks like it's gonna be awesome. Here's a look at the stage. It looks very, very intriguing. Many eons ago, there lived an enlightened Maharaja and Maharani of Anandapur whose hearts were one with 
nature. And now, this is my favorite part of each day, as the birds fly here to join me in a dance to welcome you. <laughs> you and I love you. Oh, I love you too, Doug. The wilderness must be explored. This one was a lot more focused on Doug and Russell, and they kind of took up a lot of time, but they didn't really do much. And then there were fewer birds, so eee, I'm not that crazy about it. Sorry, unpopular opinion, maybe. Uh, but we're headed off to Dinosaur now, and then we're trying to decide if we're gonna stick around for the day until our evening fast pass, or if we're gonna take a, a midday break, so we'll, we'll find out. Time for Dinosaur. I love this ride, I think it's one of the more underrated rides at Disney World, actually. I think it's great. Listen up, we've got to get in, grab the iguana dog, and get out for the half point hit. Let's roll. Never again. Yes, yes, yes. That was the worst. 
Never again. And now we are in line for a ride at Disney World that I have never done, which is the Triceratops Spin in Animal Kingdom. It's a spin, it's like Dumbo, but with dinosaurs. Um, but it's one of the few rides I've never ridden at Disney World, so it's gonna be a Disney kitty first. There's only one first time. Okay, we're on the Triceratops spin. Oh, it's really cute up here. I love it. Going to be well. Finding Nemo the Musical. It's my favorite show on Disney World property. I'm super pumped. Probably won't film anything because um, my camera's low on batteries, but I'm really excited. I'm gonna come out singing the songs, I'm sure. Oh, I'm so excited. I love this show. <sighs> my favorite thing. Pandora finally. Pam's never been, so it's a day of firsts for, for both of us. Um, we got a fast pass for a flight of passage. We might do Navi River, just depends on the weight, because eh, on that one. Um, but we're having like the best day at Animal Kingdom. Every day is the best day. Every day except for one day was <laughs> the best day here. Um, yeah, so see you over at Pandora. We are now entering Pandora. And there's this big thing that always kind of freaks me out. It reminds me of Little Shop of Horrors. Has anyone seen that movie or musical with the big man-eating plant? That's what this makes me think of. Kind of freaky. What do you think so far? It's cool. It's very jungly. It's very jungly. I yes. remember the Avatar movie. You don't need to know anything about the movie. Into the airlock. I never get sick of that. One of my favorite favorite things in Disney World for sure. What do you think? Amazing. Super amazing. Yeah. The best part was the bike things that felt like you were on the actual animal. Because it like because it was breathing. Yeah. Underneath you like a horse. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. You gotta get yourself on flight of passage if you haven't yet. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cute too. Coffee is life. Coffee is life. The coffee goes in and the love comes out. So we're taking a break from Pandora and we're back on the Gorilla Falls Trail. Drinking some coffee and watching this guy. I could really go for a salad right now, I'm not gonna lie. I haven't had a vegetable in like nine days. Conditioned air, fine food and drinks. Cam and I just sat down at the Yak and Yeti restaurant, which is in the Asia section of Animal Kingdom. I've actually never eaten here before. I know a lot of people eat here and like it, and um, it's kind of like an Asian Asian fusion ish. Um, I'm looking forward to it. We, I ordered the chicken tikka masala. Cam got a noodle bowl, and um, we also got these sparkling waters. And this is a, a pear flavored sparkling water, and it's delicious and it's refreshing. And um, I'm happy so far. I'll let you know how the food is, but it's kind of fun. We're on the second floor. 
So when I look out the window, I can see a little uh, view of the park, which is kind of fun. It's really good. Okay, the food has arrived. I got the chicken tikka masala, which hopefully is good. It's kind of hard to do it wrong, but I'm just crossing my fingers. Um, and Pam got this uh, noodle dish with tofu that looks really, really good too. So I'll let you know how it is, but I'm pretty, I'm pretty hungry, I'm not gonna lie. We have finished eating, the food was very good, the chicken tikka was good, Pam's dish was good, and then tomorrow's Pam's birthday, so she's wearing her little birthday button a little bit early. And they just brought us a lovely little birthday treat. Well, they brought it for Pam, but I'm probably gonna have a bite. So there it is, Pam's first Disney birthday treat. You gotta remember to wear your birthday button when you're in Disney and it's your birthday. All right, we are back in Pandora. We're gonna ride Navi River Journey. We got a last minute fast pass for that, so we've gotten super lucky. The standby time is 70 minutes on this, and I would never wait 70 minutes for this. Sorry, I wouldn't. Um, not that it's not a nice ride, it is, but this is fast pass or like short wait only for me. Pam's back there, she's looking around. It's been an amazing day. It's been a big day at Animal Kingdom, but we've gotten super lucky on fast passes and short wait times and beautiful weather and just the way to do it.